America stands at a crossroads. A choice awaits us. One path leads to destruction. The other path leads to love. Which way will we go? The answer lies within each of us. We must choose wisely. Our nation is deeply divided. Political battles rage. Anger and fear fill the air. It's easy to feel lost in the chaos, but we cannot give in to despair. We must remember who we are. We are a nation founded on hope. We are a people capable of great love. Now is the time to tap into that love. Now is the time to choose unity over division. Our future depends on it. The choice is ours to make. Let us choose wisely. Let us choose love. The chasm between us seems vast. On one side, we see a desire for unity. People crave compassion and understanding. They long for a nation where everyone feels valued and respected. They believe in the power of cooperation to solve our problems. On the other side, chaos reigns. Division and mistrust fester. Fear fuels anger and resentment. This path offers no solutions, only more pain. It seeks to divide us, to turn us against each other. The choice before us is stark. Will we embrace the forces of unity and love, or will we succumb to the allure of chaos and division? The answer will determine the fate of our nation. The path of destruction is paved with anger. It thrives on fear and mistrust. It whispers in our ears, telling us to be afraid of those who are different. It urges us to build walls instead of bridges. This path leads only to more pain, more suffering. When we choose destruction, we choose division. We choose to see enemies instead of neighbors. We choose to perpetuate cycles of violence and hate. This is not the America we are meant to be. We are better than this. We are capable of so much more. We have the power to choose a different path, a path of healing and hope. Section four, the power of love's embrace. Love is the most powerful force in the universe. It has the power to heal wounds and bridge divides. Love calls us to see beyond our differences and recognize our shared humanity. It compels us to listen with open hearts and minds. When we choose love, we choose understanding. We choose empathy over judgment. We choose to build bridges of compassion and walk hand in hand towards a brighter future. This is the America we must strive to be. Love is not weak. It is not naive. Love is the most courageous act there is. It takes strength to choose love in the face of fear. It takes courage to choose unity in the face of division. Section five, our choice, our power. The power to choose our path lies within each of us. We can choose to meet anger with compassion. We can choose to respond to fear with love. We can choose to build bridges instead of walls. Every day we make choices that shape our world. We choose our words, our actions, our reactions. These choices may seem small, but they have the power to create ripples of change. We must never underestimate the power we possess. We have the power to choose love. We have the power to choose unity. We have the power to create a better world for ourselves and for generations to come. Section six, a moral imperative. Our choice is not just a political one, it is a moral one. We are called to love our neighbors as ourselves. This call transcends political parties, religious beliefs, and any other difference that may divide us. Throughout history, movements for justice and equality have been fueled by love. From the civil rights movement to the fight for LGBTQ plus rights, love has been the driving force behind positive change. These movements remind us of the power of love to overcome hate and create a more just and equitable world. Love is not a passive force, it is a call to action. It compels us to stand up for what is right, to fight for justice, and to create a world where everyone feels loved, valued, and respected. This is the legacy we must strive to leave for future generations. Let us choose love. Let us choose unity. Let us choose to build a better America together.